running crisscrosses for five minutes unbroken for five minutes without making any mistakes can i do it i don't know hey everyone welcome back to the channel so i've been uh, attempting this five minute non-stop crisscross goal you might call it for for a little while here today and hopefully i'm going to get it this time so a little while ago i uploaded a very detailed uh, crisscross tutorial video and in that video i said that i could do the crisscross for minutes on end without making mistakes and on my channel i used to do three minutes straight of running crisscrosses. Someone asked me, how about five minutes? Could I do it for five minutes? I don't know, that's what I'm trying to do here today. Hopefully this is the attempt. Wish me luck everyone. Try to do a move for several repetitions in a row. A funny thing happens. When you first start learning the move, you have to be ultra focused on your technique. But then after a while, your body can perform the move almost by itself. So right now my mind, I'm focused on what I'm doing. But at the same time, my mind, my mind is wandering. I'm letting it wander. I'm looking at the things around me, thinking about a few things. January 1st, 2022 today. So I'm just thinking about last year, this year. But at the same time, conscious of what I'm doing, what my body's doing. My body's almost doing it by itself too. Focused, my mind not focused too unfocused make a mistake as you saw there when I first tried and it's so cold today makes it a little bit more difficult to breathe I get my breath right here. How long has it been? I have no idea. Show through your screen at home. Let me know. sunshine. Cold but beautiful. Get some vitamin D on my legs.
Eric Thomas says, don't give up. Don't quit. You're already pain. You're already in pain. Get a reward for it. So I know if you're doing a challenge and maybe fatigue sets in, you've already done a few repetitions or a few minutes, perhaps a few hours, you feel like giving up. That's a nice little quote. If you're already in pain, get a reward for it. Of course, we want to listen to our body within reason. We don't want to push ourselves too far past our limits and cause damage. Did you notice what happened there? We can see here in slow motion. When I'm doing crisscrosses, when I'm crossing the rope, I try to point the handles, not directly down to the ground, but at an angle down towards the ground. And then what happens is I start crossing the rope, bringing my arms closer and closer to parallel to the ground where I'm almost forming a 90 degree angle at my elbows and when you're doing that you're bringing the rope higher up and therefore you're shortening the rope you're increasing the likelihood that the rope is going to hit your legs 